Have a deep conversation. First of all, why are deep conversations important at all? Like, why should you care? Well, you can see it as they are a symbol of intimacy. You get a glance at the underlying universe that is someone else. Yeah, that's hyperbole, but it's true. Someone's life is so complex. And the thing is, you don't even know the most of your life. Discovering someone else's life is that's a roller coaster. Deep conversations are so much more satisfying than shallow ones. This isn't this is just fact. Even though it's technically in my opinion, I just it's just, it's just a fact at this point. So much better. Like, do you really enjoy the repeated lines of, oh, the weather's good. Oh, how's your day? No. Deep conversations are also a source of intellectual stimulation and they don't always need to be, but they can be an avenue to intellectual stimulation. And this is important because when you're talking to someone who is challenging your ideas, what you're doing is you are reformulating, reorganizing your thoughts. You're making your points stronger. You're revealing the weaknesses you haven't thought about. And this allows learning to occur. It allows betterment of your own personal views. Because for one, you don't know if that other person knows more than you. They, well, actually you do know. You know for sure that they know something more than you. But you don't know if they might know something more than you about a specific topic. They might. And you may never know it because you didn't have a deep conversation with them. The thing is, are you really connecting with someone if you're having a shallow conversation? I don't think so. I think that if you only have shallow conversations, you're really lonely. This is kind of an extension of the idea that of being lonely, but not being alone. You aren't physically alone. You're surrounded by people, but you feel lonely because you're not connecting with anyone. And connecting with people is important because we're social animals. And the thing is, shallow conversation doesn't really connect you with anyone, so... I think you're lonely if you only have shallow conversations. So, have at least one deep conversation once a week. To facilitate this, this better, no phones, at least 30 minutes in person. Three things. Just three things. Do it. Try it. There is a danger of scrutinizing people, and I've especially felt this, where I, I only want to have deep conversations. And the thing is, anyone I perceive as shallow, I just don't want to talk to. And the thing is, for the most part, people are deep. It's just your perspective on them. You may believe that some people are just not that deep, but you don't know. You don't know what they're like. You have no idea. 
you want to avoid actively labeling people as not deep. Always be open. Don't close your doors. So, deep conversations are necessary. And I mean, you can live without them. You just live pretty miserably. <laughs>